Before you begin assembling, check the rough opening dimensions and assemble your tools. The requirements for a KD side light frame are that the rough opening height equals the finished opening height plus one inch. The rough opening width equals the finished width plus two inches. Tools required to install the KD side light are a level, square, Phillips screwdriver, string, tape measure, rubber mallet, wood block, pencil, and a frame spacing bar. Begin with the door jam in a vertical position. Then back off the compression anchor in the top of the jam. Insert the frame head over the corner clips of the door jam and raise in position over the side jam. Using a wood block and mallet, align the miter of the jam with the miter on the head. Make sure the jam and the head are fully wrapping the sheetrock wall. Insert the corner clips of the remaining jam into the opposite end of the head and then position the second jam on the wall. Again using the wood block and mallet align the two miters together. With the perimeter of the frame approximately centered in the rough opening, level and square the frame using the top compression anchors for adjustment. The compression anchors can be tightened by turning clockwise, but do not tighten the bottom compression anchor at this time. Install base anchor screws into the bottom of the jam farthest from the mullion. This is usually the door hinge jam. Make sure the jam farthest from the mullion is plumb and level as this will determine the accuracy of the rest of the frame. Next, slip top of the mullion, the end with the notch, over the mullion stirrup located in the head with the base of the mullion tipped towards the secured jam. Slide the mullion into place so it is approximately vertical. Push base of the unsecured jam back on the wall and slip sill into place. Locate a removable frame spacing bar and door opening to maintain the proper opening width for the door. Pull the unsecured side jam with the sill piece and mullion toward the frame spacing bar. Make sure the base of the mullion is against the frame spacing bar. To properly align the base of the frame, run a string across the faces of both jams and position the face of the mullion in line with the jam faces. Mark location of mullion on floor. Making sure the vertical mullion stays against the frame spacing bar, push the jam back onto the wall to loosen the assembly. Lift the sill piece and secure the mullion foot clip anchor with screws to the floor. Lower the sill piece to the floor. Using the compression anchor, tighten the unsecured jam against the sill. Remember to turn the compression anchor clockwise to tighten the jam to the wall. To complete the assembly, secure the bottom of the jam in place with base anchor screws. As you can see, our KD side light frame can easily be installed with common hand tools. The result is a great looking frame with fast installation and fewer headaches. For more information on the Curry's KD side light or any of the other solutions available from Curry's, you can contact your Curry's customer service professional at 641-423-1334 or email curry's at curry's.com. You can also contact Asa Abloy Door Security Solutions at 800-377-3948 or email info at asaabloydss.com.